press the OK button to wake the unit up and again to go into the menu. Click OK on the configuration. It's set to off by default. So press the OK button to change programs to on. Then the up button and select back. This will take you to the program menu. Press OK to enter. The first icon C is for having a look at what you've already got set. We don't have anything set at the moment, so let's move on to set heating times. Press the OK button on set heating times and it will ask which days you wish to set. Click OK on all of the days that you wish to set. OK for Monday, for example. You can select as many days as you like. For example, selecting the first five days would be for the week. The weekend can be set separately on the next set heating times. Press OK to set those up. Now the first set of times is usually from midnight onwards. If this radiator was in a bedroom, for example, we might want it to start at midnight until the time we get up, for example, which would be seven o'clock. Now during that time, we wouldn't want it to be particularly warm, so we can reduce that temperature down to 14 degrees, for example, for the temperature overnight. When we get up in the morning from seven until say nine o'clock, for example, we might want it to be a bit warmer whilst we're getting ready, getting dressed, for example. So we increase the temperature to 20 degrees. If you're a working person and you're not going to be using that room going forward for the rest of the day, we can set it from nine until the time we go to bed, 10 o'clock. Now during the day, we don't want the radiator to be on unless it gets very cold. So we can set that back down to 14 degrees. Then when we're using the bedroom again, from 10 o'clock until say 11 o'clock, we can have the temperature increased so it's a bit warmer in there again. And then lastly, to complete a full day from 11 o'clock when we've gone to bed and we don't want the heating on anymore until midnight, we can reduce the temperature again so it doesn't come on overnight. Now once you've finished, press the down arrow and click OK on the return key. We can check this now by pressing the down arrow and going on C and choosing a day that we've just programmed, Monday to Friday, for example. That then shows us what we've programmed in there, when it's going to come on, when it's going to go off, and what temperature it's going to be at. When we're finished in this menu, we press back and back again. You can see, as indicated by the clock symbol here, that we're in timed mode.